So, for the February video, today we are at Disneyland, starting off California Adventure. It's early in the morning, we're gonna be here all day. Hope that don't look too blown out. But uh, this is gonna be a fun day. I haven't been here in probably over 15 years now, so it should be a lot of fun. Soaring World, Soaring World did that first. Pretty cool. I remember when it was uh, you went through California. This one you go through the whole world. And the world's bigger than California, but it's pretty cool. Everything Disney does is just full of small details and it's just like student of art or student of science, you got to appreciate it. It was all had to be custom made. This entire place is custom made. Uh, I'll try to show some details, uh, I'll make a point to it. Always like this. A cool lesson in forced perspective. I think this is so cool. In this imagination campus, they did a we people I came here with, one of their friends was performing, but it was my old high school from 20 years ago, kids today. Uh, we get to perform at Disneyland, so cool. So good. got to come see Riverside Talent. Support your local talent. It all helps us develop really cool stuff like um, like these spider bots, for example. Check it out, they have this really cool self-replicating feature. Because? Uh, this is awesome. Buddy, you can stop doing that now. But anyway, you guys are here today to help us test the Web Slayer vehicle. Using onboard tech, you will be able to sling webs just like my buddy Spider-Man. Hey there, your presentation is getting away from you. Yeah, I'm a little bit sure. If you could just initiate the safety protocols, it'd be great. The problem with that, so anyway, if you want to sling a web, all you gotta do is sling your arm in the direction you want to shoot the web, and that's it. It's awesome. Peter, your spider bots are continuing to replicate and are consuming everything oh. in their path. Spider-Man web thing. That was pretty neat. You kind of like extend your arm out. I had the GoPro up to kind of get it. I didn't know if it was a screen right or not, but I realized that uh, it's, it's out of sync or it's not polarized or whatever, so it's probably unwatchable. Oh, it's dark in that a bit. 
kind of hard to shoot in the middle of the day, but uh, overall pretty cool experience. The ambiance is just perfect. So, California Adventure. Pretty cool, it's so bright. Uh, and now we're on to the Disneyland Park itself. Main Street USA. I've always loved the design of this. I feel every city in America should strive to have something of this level. That you'll, a place you'll want to be, an outdoor room. Uh, the space is just fantastic. That's the Millennium Falcon. It's so amazing to grow up with that and then now to see it in what's probably pretty close to one to one. It's so bright out. Oh, adjust camera. But I think that is pretty cool. And they have it positioned to where when you see it, it just really sticks out at you. That is so cool. So glad they built that. Something I definitely wanted to try here was the blue milk. Uh, this little guy, not very big, was like nine bucks, but it's really tasty. It's kind of like a tropical, like a bubble gum flavor. It didn't taste, I thought it was gonna be more pineapple-y, but uh, I love making smoothies, and this is actually something I wanted to make. Um, something, there's rice milk, I can taste dragon fruit. I don't know, somebody probably has the message online, but it's pretty cool, but I was hoping to get like a big giant mega glass. Probably get the green one too. So we had food at the, uh, here in the Galaxy's Edge. I, <clears throat> anytime I'm trying to do something, I always try vegan options, and uh, I'm not a vegan or vegetarian, but it was very good. One thing that I really respect about this place is that all of the stonework, every little design is so well designed and well thought out, so intricate. 
Uh, it's amazing how like a lot of places there's very little design consideration and human experience and attention to detail. And then you come here where every little square inch is well thought out. Like this stonework behind me, it's just gorgeous. Like if you appreciate people making interesting things, this place is just so cool. Look at behind me. Uh, so Galaxy's Edge, total thumbs up, but the food was pretty good. Never done that. That was cool. It was a lot neater than I thought it was. Definitely check that out. We did a couple trips around on the train. Pretty cool, checking out Toontown now. Haven't been here in a long time. My batteries are running low, so this is probably gonna be it for the video. I'll just have whatever clips afterwards. This is a fun time. Uh, thank you to the folks who took me. Uh, this is really cool. Uh, I haven't been, I've been to Disneyland in a long time. This place is an artist's paradise. The amount of creativity and detail and use of space is unparalleled. It's probably the best designed place in America. So anyway, I'll see you next month, but here's hopefully a bunch of clips and stuff. Uh, I'm all out of batteries, so have fun everyone.